First off, we would like to give hearty congratulations to your achievement in earning your master's degree. And as you may know, attending the Old Important graduation ceremony is the final step in completing your academic journey. With that in mind, we're going to show you how you should properly wear your master's degree graduation and song via this handy tutorial. Master's degree, how to wear your cap. Your graduation cap is definitely one of the most defining things that complete your graduation in song. Here are some important tips on how you should wear your cap during your commencement ceremony. The front of your cap is indicated in the inside of your crown, so make sure you look closely for this marker before wearing the cap on your head. The cap should be worn so that the mortar board is level. It should not be tilted to the back or the side of the head. The crown should be approximately one inch above your eyebrows. Your tassel is worn over the left or right temple depending on the school's tradition. All graduates should wear the tassel on the same side for uniformity. Some schools switch the tassel from one side to the other in unison after all diplomas have been received. Master's Degree – How to Wear Your Masteral Gown The gown is worn with a zipper in front. The hem of the gown should strike you at the mid-chin. Master's degree gowns have unique and oblong shaped sleeves with wrist openings. You should merely pull your hands over through the wrist opening and let the back of the sleeve hang down and have a square cut at the bottom. Under your gown, you should wear light, comfortable clothing. So please take this into account so that you won't feel any discomfort during the graduation ceremony. As for shoes, flats, or heels are fine and do not affect the way you wear your gown. Master's Degree – How to Wear Your Hood The academic hood is a symbol of your personal and academic achievement. It's the means by which your degree and the college awarding the degree are easily identified. The size and shape of the hood show the degree level with the doctor being the largest followed by the master. The colors of the satin lining are those approved by the college or university where the degree was earned while the color of the velvet border indicates the field of study. Place the hood around your neck and shoulders so that the largest portion hangs down the back. Fasten the cord in front of the hood to your shirt dress or gown to keep the hood away from your neck. From the front, the velvet border should be closest towards your neck with the velvet displayed. Now fasten the cords to the buttons that are at the top of the hood. The cord helps to keep the hood in place to show the lining. To expose the lining, turn the velvet border to the outside as shown in red and white. And there you have it. You've just viewed a handy crash course on how to wear your graduation cap and gown for your master's degree. Now you're a master's graduate ready to conquer your graduation ceremony with confidence.